jokes to the side, nigga, know that they ain't fucking with the flow I provide. Y'all. What's going on YouTube? It's your boy the Retro Wiz Kid, the Shoeologist, and y'all rocking with your boy in the sneaker dungeon, y'all. Hope everybody's having a great day. Today we're gonna take a look at a pair of shoes that I, I actually thought the shoe was trash when I saw the pictures of it. I watched a couple videos. I haven't really watched and went on the Instagram, or should I say, to see people with the on-foot action with the shoe, but it's like the shoe is one of those shoes that it kind of looks fuego to your boy. So I'm we're gonna share the shoe with y'all. So with all that being said, let's get straight into this video today. Get it! We have the Dorn Becker Freestyle Box. So y'all already know recently we had a bunch of Dorn Beckers drop. Which pair it is? Hmm. I'm gonna let y'all think about that real quick. And we in there. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord. Man, look. I'm I, I like 14s, y'all. I do. Now, these. They fuego to me, y'all, and I must say they they fire flames actually in hand, y'all. The uniqueness of this shoe making me want to double back in January and pick these up, man. No cap, man. I probably now let's go ahead and take a nice little detailed look at the shoe and why it's made up the way that it is made. And yeah, y'all already know. We have the Air Jordan 14 Retro DB Black White Court Purple Motai and it is a suggested retail sticker of $200. And there you have it, the Air Jordan 14 Dornbecker. These things look way better in person, I must say, than they do on actual images and even on videos that I've seen of the shoes. They look way better in person and it has totally changed my mind, y'all. Let's dive into this review. Ethan Ellis, the speed demon, he's 16 years old. He had a heart defect with a heart transplant. The shoe that he decided to choose was the Air Jordan Retro 14. So good luck keeping up with Ethan Ellis. This athletic mile a minute guy is a passionate about basketball and dreams of playing professional one day. Despite six open heart surgeries, Ethan has managed to maintain his positive attitude and wickedly funny sense of humor. His iconic Air Jordan design is a tribute to both the game he loves and the people and places that were part of his health journey. As part of the remarkable partnership between Nike and OHSU Dornbecker Children's Hospital. Each year, six young patients design a limited edition Dornbecker Freestyle Collection with all proceeds benefiting the hospital. Now in the 16th year, 24 million has been raised to help save lives, develop new treatments, and provide the best care for kids. So Ethan's original concept inspired by his fandom of the TCU horn frogs and various elements of his treatment against congenital heart defect proudly stands firm as it represents the Dornbecker freestyle mission. Seen here in these shoes, you're, you can see that it is based off that TCU color palette, but also include a number of heart surgeries he's endured, the city of his heart transplant, the names of the hospitals where he received care, and even the name of a fellow patient that went through the same medical treatment. These released on December 7, 2019 for a suggested retail sticker of $200. So I hope you guys enjoyed the full detailed review of the Dorn Becker 14s. This is the second Dorn Becker that we've had on the channel. We did the Dorn Becker 6s when they came out. I believe I've only done two DBs on my channel, man. But yes, these things right here are crispy, fresh, and clean. I'm actually digging these, man. I'm really digging these. Now, I would say that I probably... If I was to pick these up, because I might still pick these up, I would probably just go with the classic laces in these, man. Even though I love, I'm a sucker for having like the nice different aglets on the shoes and stuff like that. You do have a special pair of hard aglets paws on that right there. So that is something that I think is unique about the shoe as well. 
And it's just, I don't know, man. I'm not really, I don't I don't think I really feel having regular shoestrings in 14s. It just doesn't look right to me. But it's a, it's a dope touch, y'all. Let me know down in the comment section below if you picked a pair of these things up. If you picked up any of the Doran Beckers that came out. Shout out to my bro 210 Got Kicks. He also just hit 2,000 subscribers. He was on the live the other week with us. He actually let me get this video for you guys right here. He hit on this size 9. And he was like, hey, Retro, you want to do a video on these things? And I, of course, I'm never going to turn it down, man. I want to know what people think about the shoes and if I don't have the shoe and I can bring you guys the video and get your guys' opinion on how you all feel about the shoe as well as just me giving you guys my opinion as well. So very, very Fuego shoe, very different. And you know what's crazy? Y'all know that fish book back in the day in elementary school? That's what this reminds me of. It reminds me of that fish book. Uh, I can't even think what the name of that book is, man, but y'all know what book I'm talking about. If I can find a picture, I'll pin it right here. But this is what this remind me of. That remind me of that fish book, man. That is exactly what that remind me of. And it, it just remind me of like having some candy paint or something. I don't know, man, but very fuego shoe. Check out the pictures at the end of the video. I love you guys. Of course, we're going to be traveling in the GA this week, man. So I'll be doing some stuff at the crib. Then I got a partner that I'm trying to link up with as well that does YouTube as well. So you guys might know who it is. If we should be able to link up, you'll see it in the video, y'all. So it is your boy, the Retro Wiz Kid. I love you guys. Peace, love, and Laguna Beach. And I'm going to catch y'all in the next video. Yay!